So Tim is the butcher as well as co-owner of Launders and I want to talk to you about how to choose a quality beef. How to choose a good roast. You're going to have a dinner party. Okay. What do I want to get? Okay, uh, first things you need to do is find butcher that dry ages the beef. Now I take it you, you are such we a butcher. We are such a butcher. So I age the beef around 28 days and uh, then you need to find out what the marbling content is. It needs to be an A3 or prime. Uh, that, what does that mean? That gives you uh, enough marbling in the meat to help with it staying juicy and help to give you more flavor. All right, can you okay. show me one of those roasts? Sure. So that's uh, an A3 prime rib roast and uh, so it's got good marbling. Um, it's been aged a month to, which helps in the tenderness. As the beef ages the uh, sinews and tendons break down so the meat becomes more tender. It assures you more tender. You may get a roast that uh, you may get lucky on a one that has only seven days but chances to, to assure that you're going to get better quality all the time you want to get something that's been aged uh, how, properly. How is it but, aged? So you have to uh, hang it in big pieces. So it's referred to as swinging meat. <laughs> you have to swing your meat. Okay. And, uh, so you can't take home a roast and try and age it in your fridge. It won't work. Um, it has to be suspended where it's not touching anything else. Right. And it will hang that way for a month before I will start to cut it up. And how do you recommend you prepare your roast? Uh, I, you know, we talked earlier about uh, things like marinating or uh, rubbing. I would say not to marinate it. Um, I let the meat stand for itself. Uh, if it's good quality, it's well aged and it's done properly, you'll get good flavor. But so just season the outside the way you like it, garlic, black pepper and then serve a sauce on the side is what I would suggest. Yeah, that sauce on the side is important in my household when I just have it in the oven a little bit too long. <laughs> it's always nice to get the HP <laughs> sauce out. And, anyways, but if I'm going to buy a roast like that, I'm going to do it right. Yeah, good. Okay, well, thank yeah. you very much. Thank you. You have a beautiful shop. So, again, their website is www.monders.ca. They're located on Young Street. Beside Hearst Bakery, you might as well stop there too and get your dessert and your breads. And uh, so what is your address? 15543 Young Street. All right. So Maunders, this is where you come and get your swinging meat. <laughs>